This past weekend, I showed Hank at the Cow Horse Show in Andalusia, Alabama, and I thought I'd go over the run with you and tell you about how the run went and go over the scores and thought you might might be something you would enjoy seeing. Uh, this is Hank that I'm showing. Uh, Hank has not been shown in over a year. This is his first show back. We had actually qualified him for two world shows or three world shows when COVID hit and we ended up not taking him to any of them because of COVID. Uh, watch this gate right here. We're going to flip a lead right there and then we flip it back. That's going to affect my score. I'll show you that in just a minute when I show you my scores. But anyway, this is his first show back and uh, I was pretty much just going for a nice easy uh, raining pattern, not too, nothing extreme one way or another, just do it correct. And uh, when you go in the pin, you go in with a 70 and you either go up or down from there depending on the maneuvers and your maneuvers you perform. So for those first circles, for my right circles, I scored a minus one half for the maneuver score with a one point penalty for flipping that lead. Now we're into the left circles, uh, big fast, small slow, then big fast. I score these uh, circles a minus one half also. And the main reason I score them a minus one half is I don't have enough speed difference between my big fast and my small slow. The big fast needed to be a little bit faster and the small slow needed to be a little bit smoother, a little bit rounder. And uh, overall, he got it pretty good. And uh, we're coming around for our, our second big fast circle and we'll swap leads and go the other direction. Like I said, I scored a minus one half for those left circles and there's my lead change. When you're scoring, when you're showing this, you go in the pin with a score of a 70 and then your score goes either up or down depending on the quality of the maneuver and any penalties. The, this is the rundown and stop. The scoring for this stop actually started after my lead change. So I run down, do this stop. I scored a, a zero maneuver score, which means it's average, no added degree of difficulty or no, no problems with, this, with the stop. Here's, here's my right spins. Scored a plus one half for those spins. Now I'm going to lope down to get my next stop. There's several things I could do to get these scores up. I was going for a, a smooth, easy run on him. I scored a zero for that stop, zero maneuver score. And this was his first time back in the show pen in over a year. So I was just trying to go uh, correct with really no degree of difficulty. There was a little bobble there starting my spin, but once I got started, the spin was nice. I scored a zero maneuver score for that spin. Now I'm going to settle just a minute before I go into my stop and back. I lope off. And stop and back up. And I scored a zero maneuver score for here for a total of 68 and a half. So now I'm going to call for my cow, smash my hat down on my head, and they'll send the cow out to me. I have to box him on the end of the arena, turn him once each direction on the fence, and then circle him each direction. The judge wants to see the horse read the cow and work the cow with just help from me, but the horse actually do the cow work, reading the cow. My boxing here was, was pretty good. I checked the boxing. When I set him up here to take him down the fence, I could have set him up a little bit better, but I, I still got a check and a check plus on my two fence turns. I need to get him back to the other side, run him down this fence over here. I have to get him past that red and white marker there, but turn it, that red and white marker, but turn him before the end red and white marker. Now we'll get our second turn here and then I'll circle. I, uh, I check plus the uh, degree of difficulty and I check plus control. So I ended up with a score of 71, which is a pretty good score. Uh, coming back from him, his first time showing since uh, in about a year and a half. So that was our, our run. Uh, we ended up with a, an okay score for him. We actually ended up getting a first place check. And I think we're going to look at maybe running him for a world title next year. We definitely have uh, 
things that we can improve on, things that he can do better. And uh, I believe that uh, he can do some really nice things next year. Until next time, thank you for watching.